When I say use your feet, I mean to make shot from your center down to your foot. If my foot was off the floor, it would look like this. I would go push, move, push, move, push, move, push. My feet are not off the floor, but I still have that shot against the ground. Push, push, push. Different than just moving your hip. You want a wave to go through your body, out your arm, shot, shot, push, driving out to the target. When you're making that shot, it is quite often that people throw too far. They shock and they push themselves apart. And instead of reaching out for the target, you want your body to be compressed when you hit the target, and make pressure into the ground. So what will really help with this is your drawing side. Use your legs and center to pull your elbow and fist into the ground, into your back leg. So the sensation is going to be that you're going to start pulling, pull, and continue pulling to punch. Pull, punch. Some people go pull, push, and they push apart. So if there's a big change from this position to your pulling position, then you didn't quite do the right thing. Thought of a time. Imagine it hanging onto a handle, squeezing with your center, pull down on your back leg. One. Grab onto the handle, pull down onto the floor. Two. Start to pull. One. Two. Start to pull. On both actions, try to feel like your inner thighs guide you towards the center. So most people get it on the counter punch. They punch, everything's good. They jab, that's so good. There's no pressure here in your legs, nothing guiding you towards the target. The sensation is more like, even though this hip twisted back, it's part of the impact point. So you squeeze, and these aim, even though you're sideways, they pull together. Give it a try. Grab and pull. One, two punches, one cup, head stomach. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch hands, switch hands, switch side. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Almost everybody in the world does a light jab with a heavy punch, which is okay if that's your intent. But there are times when your jab has to be the finishing blow or the impact. So instead of a rhythm that always goes light, heavy, Light heavy, where this one is really nothing, it's just a slough. You want to learn to focus that with Kime. So you're going to start in your jab. You're going to do two punches, and you're going to go squeeze, 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 squeeze. So this pulls together, they hit. They feel way different. Probably not doing it right.